the rights work that we do, so children's rights work. And I thought I'd use a specific example that we've been involved in recently. So, you know, we, we're very much um, a rights-based, we take a rights-based approach to everything we do as an organisation, really. You know, we're very, you know, our, our work is really informed by that UN, UNCRC document, really. Um, so we're a member of the Scottish Alliance for Children's Rights, which is called Together Scotland. So you can have a look at that on our website. Um, and one of our long-standing campaigns is something called Equal Protection. I sent you the thing, if I've sent you something on that anyway, which is, I think it's on the email actually. A really interesting document to have a look at. So it's a review of the evidence of the physical punishment of children. So I thought I'd ask you a question about, it said, I used to uh, do safeguarding training in the organisation I used to work for and it was a scenario, scenario I always used in kind of, you know, kind of looking at child protection issues was around smacking children. And I just wondered, kind of a question out to the room, what people thought about it, really? Kind of parents punishing their children through smacking. Not right. Uh, not right. I think it depends what, in what way they're smacking their child. Like if they're actually like just constantly hitting them for no actual reason, or if they're tapping them on the hand or something. I don't see them wrong tapping them on the hand just a little bit, but not like full blown smacking them on the bum. I think in terms of uh, the traces of abuse in the family, just to hear the abuse in the I think it's possibly depending on the child. Um, like the not the behaviour, but how they would respond to possibly getting like tap in the hand or something. Yep. I find that most of people who are over 30 all had uh, a parent who smacked them. Yeah, I did. Them. Yeah. Um, and I understand where it came from. I understand it was uh, a need of parents um, to, well, for children to realize that you're supposed to uh, have a respect towards others and stuff and not to do certain things. Um, I think it will be very, very difficult for younger generations to uh, completely get rid of smacking their own children because what they had in the in past. And even though as a mom, I never wanted to do it and I still done it and I wasn't proud of that. Mm. But I think it's just the root so badly inside us that it will come up eventually, but hopefully it will, it will fade out as we grow the generation. Does anybody know what the current law is in Scotland? It's illegal then, is it? Well, it's being made illegal, yes, but it's not currently. So does anybody know kind of what, what the, the kind of language is around it at the moment? It's like some, a 
allowing um, our parents to discipline their children like for smuggling or something, but they were still having a debate on it, either to allow it or not. So I don't know the outcome of it, if it is actually being allowed for parents to smuggle their children. So Scotland is going to be the first sort of country in the United Kingdom to, to actually ban physical um, chastisement of children. So the law at the moment is reasonable chastisement. So what does that mean? What well, is reasonable? Is so justifiable assault. Yeah. <coughs> well. There is a law, you're not allowed to, to hit another adult, mm -hmm. but we are allowed as parents to reasonably chastise our children. So that is, you know, whether it's a justifiable assault, yeah. It? Yeah, it is. And at the moment there is no, there is no plans to, I think the Welsh government are kind of talking about it at the moment, but there's no plans in England to, to change the law. Do you not think, though, they can have a stop hitting in the skill? Kids said it was a bend of the Well, <laughs> like they're not scared of teachers or anything anymore. Like you like, can talk back to them and you can not go happy. Like, I mean, doesn't that take high school to have the police car? Well, I don't like, think that would happen. Like, like lock the door to keep the children safe. Eye, like, eye. what? Well, there is, you know, I suppose there is there's a lot of it, different influences now, isn't it, that, that perhaps we didn't have kind of 20 years ago that, you know, yeah, it's it's really hard, you know, it's really hard to say kind of what is the... Like I can when I've got a slap, I'm too scared to do it again. I can't remember what I was going to get off my back. I never... I never really got, I got smacked once or twice, but it was the fear of being smacked that stopped me from doing it. Like, I was scared to do anything wrong in case I got in trouble, like in case I got smacked. Thank God, you didn't hear No, I never, I never, I never, I never done it because I was scared. And yeah. Case, but my mum would have probably done it because she was pretty Yeah. Fear, you yeah, you're fear. learning through fear. Exactly, yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah. And that's not... <laughs> That's not right, is it? <laughs> it's, a, it's a very interesting debate. It's a very interesting debate. Anyway, Scotland is banning smacking and Children First will very much influence I think it is. I think it has to be parent or carer, yeah. 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 I was a childminder until this time last year, and like I would never have ever tapped one of the children's hands or anything, but I would have done it to my own child. I would never have done it to anybody else's child. Because so does that come right? against the law here? Like you're not even allowed to tap the hand? Well. Like, oh, daddy, that and tap the hand. You're not allowed to do that. I thought you meant yeah. just like smutting in the bun. How do you distinguish what the actual thing is? Because <laughs> you know, they see, see after two boys and they play quite rough with the dad, right? So there is quite, the, this is all play. This is not to do to, to harm anyone. But if the child gets harmed during the play, would that be. I don't know. That is, I think that's yet to be determined, I think. I think that. It's about it's around punishment basically, so I think the law is around physical chastisement around punishment as punishment. I know, but then the child can go to the teacher and say, "Listen, my well, child me." Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that's always that's kind of it, you know. Years 
Well, I suppose so. I think it'd be widely publicised, yeah. So it's how, it's how, it's whether that your you know children have, it's the access to that information, I suppose, isn't it? Well, let's just yeah. keep it from that. <laughs> 